Hello, in this short video I will explain you how to connect a GPS module with your Tyro 79. My Tyro 79 looks a little bit different from the original one because I'm using another frame. I used the Acrobat Cloney frame. It's because of my Cadex cam, it's a HD camera and so I have no props in the picture. But back to the GPS. I used the Ublox BN220 one. It's a cheap one, but you can only uh, you can also use another one. It's no problem. Uh, we have another problem. We have one with the flight controller of the Tyro 79. It's a F4 flight controller and it has only two free UARTs. So one of them I'm using for my controller and the other one I'm using uh, for my smart audio from the VTX. So what to do now? Um, there's a clever system. It's called soft serials. So you can use another port, for example, the LED port. If you don't use it, you can um, use the LED port for the smart audio. In the description is a link uh, from Oscar and Oscar explain how to set up this in Betafly. So you can use the LED port for um, example for your smart audio from the VTX. Um, so in my case, I'm using my controller for the TX1 and RX1 port. So um, I have the TX2 and the RX2 port free to use my Ublox BN220. The cable is the black one, it's the ground one. I sold it on a ground pad on the downside of the flight controller. The white one is the TX cable, so I sold it to the RX port here to the RX2 port on the flight controller. The green one is the RX cable, so I soldered this one to the TX2 port here on the flight controller. And the red one is the 5 volt, so I soldered it here on the 5 volt pad on the flight controller. And uh, that's it. That's a hardware configuration for a GPS module on your Tyro 79. Um, you have to connect it to the Betafly system, and in Betafly there are uh, some um, software settings you have to click and yes that's it so that's all and now you can use a gps module on your tyro 79 i hope this video saves your time